It's Mo Murphy from Clark County Sports. We're here with Brian Wallace after the big win against Hanley. Brian, your name was called a lot tonight out there on defense. Can you just talk a little bit about the game? Uh, we played, a, uh, it was tough. We came out a little bit uh, weak in the uh, first half. We stepped up definitely in the second half. I could, uh, our defensive line is one of the best. Uh, Lucas Rogers, Brett McDonald, Rico Nappy as our uh, linebackers, some of the best linebackers we've ever had and uh, just keep pushing on. What the coach say at halftime? Because it was definitely all Eagles in the second half. Mm-hmm. Coach just got us all together and made us make sure we talk when we get there to the line. We got to communicate. He got us up, got us uh, in the game, and kept kept us our minds high, our head and, high. And how was your week of practice after uh, the Millbrook game? You guys looked like you might have worked pretty hard. Yes, sir. We focused real hard. We definitely got a different mindset. Knew we had to come out, punch him in the mouth, and keep on punching. All right. Well, you heard that from Brian Wallace, a big victory over Hanley tonight, and they'll head to Central next week to start the Bull Run District play. It's Mo Murphy with Brian Wallace. Thanks Thank a lot. <laughs> it's Mo Murphy from Clark County Sports. We're here with Brett McDonald after the 35-14 uh, to 14 victory over Hanley. Brett, you got on the board with that first touchdown pass. Can you just talk a little bit about the game? Um, with that first touchdown pass, uh, we're obviously a run team. We're run first. And uh, to surprise them with a pass out early in the game, um, it just kind of shocked them. It freed me up for the touchdown. And uh, mine did great. Blocked for Chris. He got a good pass off. And uh, we, uh, we, slide, we had a couple uh, mistakes in the first half which uh, caused some points on the board. But we came out in the second half and uh, tightened up our D, and our offense was a uh, well-oiled machine. And uh, we went the ball down the field and scored our touchdowns. And what did uh, Coach Parker say at halftime because you guys came out charged up? Um, he just told us that the first half was over. We made our mistakes. We got to learn from our mistakes. Um, you can't dwell on the mistakes or else uh, they end up biting you in the second half. He said forget about it, move on. We got another half to play. And uh, that's what we did. We came out here and we played like it was a new game, and uh, it showed on the scoreboard. And now you go back on the road again. You start your bull run uh, district play against Central. Uh, what do you know about them guys? Um, Monday we'll go in, watch film, learn what we got to do on them, get a scouting report, and uh, I'm sure the coaches will put, be, have us prepared and put us in the place we need to be to get a victory there too. And just talk a little bit about uh, your rebound this week. Uh, I guess you had a pretty good week of practice. Oh, yes, sir. Um, our coaches told us that this was our uh, rebound week, that we had to come back and make a statement that uh, after getting beat by Millbrook that we had to come back and we had to uh, um, get our win streak back and uh, play hard and uh, get back to Clark County football, pounding the ball, playing tough D and uh, scoring big and scoring often. Okay, well you heard that from Brett McDonald as they have started another win streak and they'll head to Central next week. It's Mo Murphy with Brett McDonald. Thank you. Thanks a lot. It's Mo Murphy with Hunter Rogers after the big win against Hanley. Hunter, congratulations. Uh, three touchdowns tonight. Can you just talk a little bit about the game? Um, it was a good game. I think the first the first half, uh, we played a little slow. I mean, we were pounding them. Um, we were doing good. The coaches up in the box said we were controlling the offensive line, and we were. Um, once again, we had a couple. We had two misplays. Uh, they they beat us deep on that one pass here, the corner of the end zone. Um, we should have been ready for that. Um, but uh, And then the one score they had down here early, we missed tackles in the hole. We had them. We just let go, and we tried to go for a kill shot. And we we went in the locker room, and um, we talked about it. And um, we came out here second half and just did what we did. But we finished, I think, the second half of the game. And um, we got the dub. And of course, a little disappointing last week when I talked with you. But how's it feel to get that first win at home? Big crowd, Hall of Fame night. Yes, sir. Um, it feels good. I mean, obviously, everyone's here. We're uh, in our home atmosphere. Lost last week. I mean, I was over that uh, Sunday morning, but um, it feels good. And now you, you start your district play. You go down to Woodstock next week to play Central. How you feel about the Bull Run District this season? Um, I really don't know too much. I mean, Central wasn't that bad of a team last year. I mean, we came out with the win, but... We're going to go in this week like we do any other week, and we're going to watch film. We're going to see what we have to do. We're going to get our mentality right, and we're going to go in the game and do what we have to do as a team. Okay, well, you heard that from Hunter Rogers, who broke the uh, goal line three times tonight in the 35-14 to 14 win over Hanley. It's Mo Murphy with Hunter Rogers. Thanks a lot.
This is Mo Murphy with head coach Chris Parker after the big win against Hanley. Coach, uh, nice rebound from last week. Can you just talk a little bit about your team's performance? Really proud of them. Uh, you know, it was a tough first half. We were a little bit out of sync, and uh, Hanley made some uh, big plays against us. Uh, we challenged our guys at halftime, told them that you know they had to take control of the second half and win the game and do the things you have to do to win the game, uh, and they did it. And uh, you know, I, it's just you know, if you're very proud of how they kept fighting, scratching, beating, and uh, and the outcome, you know, 35-14, I can live with that. And how, uh, I'm assuming it went pretty good this week in practice? We had a good week of practice. Uh, they were focused and, uh, you know, our uh, two offensive defensive days went well. And, uh, you know, we had a good week and uh, it, it was a good win. You know, I mean, especially Hall of Fame night and we need, like you said, to bounce back. And uh, speaking of Hall of Fame, one of your ex-players, uh, Damian Hubbard, got in tonight. How do you feel when you see one of your guys go in? Oh, I feel very proud of him. I just talked to him a little bit, and uh, he's a fine young man. Uh, I just it, – it really uh, – it's part – when you're coaching or teaching, you know, when you see a young man and – well, I guess he, he's a man now. You know, he – when they do well and they grow into – you know, a positive person and citizen that really makes me feel great, and he, he certainly is. And then also Jesse Racer and Bobby Hobbs went in, just want to mention them as well. Uh, how do you feel about Central next week as you start your bull run schedule? Well, we play down there, and uh, they always have, you know, a very balanced offense. They always can throw the ball. Uh, it'll be a tough game. We've had some tough ones down there. So we're going to approach it. Uh, we do it week to week anyway, but uh, – you know, this weekend, coaches get together, it's back to the drawing board, and uh, you know, we'll come up with our game plan, what we're going to be doing. Okay, well, you heard that from Coach Chris Parker after the 35-14 to win over Hanley on Hall of Fame night. It's Mo Murphy with Coach Chris Parker at the felt. Thanks, Mo. Thanks. Thank you. I'm probably coming down there.